video chart presentation of MCOR Corp brought to you by AllPennyStocks.com. MCOR is a NASDAQ gold market stock, trading your ticker EMKR. Nice support level down here, 85, 90 cents. Made about a 10% or more move up over the last week. We keep our eye on this to try and push again and break through this dollar ten area. See, we've got a real nice look going on with the MACD. Trending smoothly back towards zero. Nice upward channel being developed. We'll keep our eye on that because if this can go up and break through that money line, it breaks through the top side of that channel and really shows a lot of strength to trend in this play. Similarly with the PPO, two very loose PPO ADX pinches, but in a very nice reversal position. Positive DI starting to trend its way upward at this point. MFIs with a solid upward trend, still holding the upper half of the indicator. That's bull chart territory. Good to see the accumulation distribution is finally putting together a little bit of an uptrend. Shake and money flow holding in the green, showing buying pressures overcoming selling pressure. CCI with some nice upward movement in the short term. Be looking for that trend line to be broken. Although it is very short, it's a good thing to see, and it'll help it push to the upper half of the indicator. Looking like it's trying to break through 50. Kind of neutral position at this point, but looks like it's trying to go bullish. And the tricks is trending upward, making a new higher high at this point. RSIs will look for that classic case of trying to break through 50. You can see it's been a struggle for it. Obviously, maintaining bear chart territory. The stock's been on a pretty big slide. I don't have any idea what went on fundamentally. It's just a technical look at this chart to make this thing fall from $3.10 to all the way down under a dollar. I'm just looking at it at this point to possibly try and recover some of those losses. Good bottom support there at $0.85. Cents. Another support there at $0.90. Cents. I'd really be keeping my eye on this now at this point since it's holding around this dollar level to see if it's going to hold a buck. If it can't hold that dollar and comes right down here, the third time might be the charm where it can't hold $0.90 cents and it tries to fall a little bit lower and continues its downward path. But right now, the indicators are definitely trying to show a shift in trend and a shift in momentum. So we're going to keep an eye on this for some upward pressure and see if it can come through and take out this dollar ten mark. If it can take that out, it's going to meet a little bit more resistance, certainly at the 50-day moving average, combined with a little bit of static resistance at a buck twenty. That's a nice upside potential, about 20% move to go up there and even challenge that. And beyond that, it's a pretty substantial move until it meets any real resistance again. Come back in around a dollar forty, certainly pick up around a dollar fifty. So it's in a pretty nice position. Can it hold this base? Let these indicators play themselves out a little bit more and see if this has got some gas in it, try and gather some more momentum and blow through some resistance points. So those are the things that we'll be keeping our eye on with the EMKR chart. But as always, it's merely my interpretation. I'm not a financial consultant. Strongly encourage you to do your own property due diligence. Consult with a qualified financial advisor before making any investment decisions. Past performance is not a guarantee of future results. Please visit the allpennystocks.com website to view the full disclaimer disclosure. I do not base any investment decisions upon any material found on the website and or video chart. No person employed by Allpenny Stocks is a registered investment advisor or licensed broker dealer. Thank you for watching and trade smartly.